now let us discuss about base register limit register and hardware address protection in memory management in operating system memory management means main memory management so in operating uh, system subject memory means main memory uh, here we know that the main memory is divided into two parts the first part specifies generally the main memory will be divided into two parts the first part specifies operating system whereas the second part specifies user processes here we have three processes process 1 process 2 process 3 here there is a possibility that a process can access operating system or here we have three processes process 1 can access process 2 process 3 process 2 can access process 1 process 3 likewise so here the problem is uh, we have to provide protection for the operating system from the user processes as well as we need to protect a process from other processes in order to provide the protection we are using two registers base register and limit register for each process so each process should have these two registers here we are focusing on second process base register here if we take here here operating system starting address is 0 whereas the last address is 10,000 whereas process 1 starting address is 10,000 ending address is uh, some 29,999 whereas process 2 starting address is 30,000 whereas uh, the ending address is uh, like uh, 49,000 whereas process 3 starting address is 50,000 likewise here base address always contains starting address of the register if we take process 2 in process 2 what is the starting address 30,000 so this 30,000 is nothing but base address whereas the second register is limit register limit register contains length of the register size of the register here if we take the second process second process totally contains 20,000 instructions 20,000 so limit is equal to 20,000 so base register contains starting address of the register whereas limit register contains length or size of the register uh, next let us discuss about uh, hardware address protection uh, here uh, uh, we have CPU CPU is generating an address if CPU generates an address, then we have to check. V means hardware. It is the whenever CPU generates an address, then it is the responsibility of the hardware to check whether that address is valid address or not. Let CPU is executing process 2. So here what are the valid addresses for process 2 from 30,000 to 50,000? So, if an instruction is from 30,000 to 50,000, then it is a valid instruction. So, that instruction will be uh, executed by the CPU. Okay? Uh, if CPU generates an address, then first we have to compare that address with base address. If base address is greater than or greater than or equal to, uh, if this address, if this address CPU generated address is greater than the base address or greater than or equal to base address. Then we can say that it is a valid address. So let the address is like 40,000. So here 40,000 is nothing but process to instruction. Okay. So this 40,000 will be compared with base address. So 40,000 is greater than for process to what is the base address? 30,000. So, 40,000 is greater than 30,000. Yes, condition is true. So, we can say that it is a valid instruction. 
then yes yes now the condition is true 40000 is greater than 30000 next we have to compare whether this base address is less than this cpu generated address is less than base plus limit or not so here cpu generated address is 40000 this 40000 is less than what is base plus limit here the base is 30000 limit is 20000 so 30000 plus 20000 means 50000 so 40000 is less than 50000 yes condition is true it is a valid instruction so yes here the condition is true so now what will happen uh, here here we have main memory so the corresponding instruction will be executed from the main memory whereas if this condition is false let us assume that that address is 25000 address is let cpu generated an address called 25000 here what is our target cpu is executing process 2 so first this address will be compared with the base address 25 is greater than what is the base address here 30000 so 25000 is greater than 30000 condition is false no if the condition is false then what will happen a trap will be generated to the operating system a trap is nothing but a fatal error trap is nothing but an error an error will be generated send you to the operating system so likewise here also if the condition is false no then a trap will be sent to the operating system so here hardware ensures that cpu is accessing a valid instruction from the main memory if the cpu is trying to access some other instruction like uh, it, it let, let that instruction is uh, some other process instruction then hardware will sense a trap to the operating system so immediately operating system will stops execution of that process so this is about base register limit register and hardware address protection in main memory management memory management